Welcome back to the channel where we explore, learn, and theorize about the Marvel Universe. Today I'll be talking about Thor's hammer and Once Upon a Time. Now let's get started. I don't know how many of you have seen Once Upon a Time, but my mom absolutely loves the show. And while she was watching it for the third, or fourth, or maybe tenth time recently, she saw this and immediately called me. So thanks mom for this video. Anyways, in the finale for Once Upon a Time Season 2, we see Thor's hammer in Rumpelstiltskin's castle. Now Once Upon a Time was made by ABC and is obviously a Disney property, as it's focused on the characters of the Enchanted Forest and various other fairy tales. But this actually has a much bigger connection, as during Season 2's finale, the first sneak peek for Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. was shown, and it all connects rather nicely, as Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. was an ABC show that mainly focused on Phil Coulson and his team. And Phil Coulson played a large role in Thor's first movie, being the one in charge of the research team that found Thor's hammer. Now as to why Mr. Gold, aka Rumpelstiltskin, has Mjolnir, and why it showed up more than once, also appearing in Season 3 Episode 2, is unknown. But maybe someone traded Thor's hammer for some magic to bring their friend back to life, and then called it Tahiti. Anyways, I just thought this was a cool easter egg, but it's really interesting as to why Thor's hammer would be in the Enchanted Forest. So if you know why, or you have any ideas, let me know down in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you'll never miss another video. Thanks for watching, and remember to wash your hands and stay safe.